What's up? I'm Matt Vincent, and today's adventure, we're here at a powerlifting meet. It's just getting wrapped up. Bonnie just got done coaching an athlete, and um, now we're off to go train and make muscles with a new friend, Kristen Nunn, super stud bodybuilder, and since I'm bad at bodybuilding type things, and I'm trying to learn to be better at them, she's gonna put me through a workout and kick the shit out of me. I'm gonna realize how bad I suck at it. So that's uh, where we're headed next. Being bad. just fucking nothing worse than like the first time you stay with a chick or a new person yeah and so you don't fart and then oh, you just you you're just like so uncomfortable miserable and like waiting for them to leave the house for five minutes yeah. <laughs> you can just yeah. fart or yeah. take a poop but even that like doesn't do it it's like no. you need days no you need a to major get back to normal but there's definitely sometimes you just have like that morning pee fart that needs yeah, to get out. Yeah, of course. It's nice loaded in there. They're always funny sounding. Make your friends good enough that you can fart in front of them. Mm. Rule number one. <laughs> Foundation Westport. Nice. And uh, this is not my standard gym that I train in, but I'm, I'm learning. Learning more of the bodybuilding machines and things that aren't four reps of bench and then call it a day. So we're going to head downstairs. Like walking lunges or something like that. This could be an area. Wow. But we're not gonna do no. that. That's a form of cardio. Oh, That's crazy. Yes, we can do some walking lunges. <laughs> no, we're all arms. Okay. It's okay. only arm day now. Uh, I'll probably jump in on a couple arm things, but I'm trying to do mostly like arms. I don't have arms fresh. So my biceps are a little sore, but not too bad. Okay, real cool, yeah. Not too bad. Okay, good. Yeah, super, super cool maybe spot. Maybe that little lower part, maybe. It is. It is the okay. lower part. Three various um, levels of hell. Yeah. Yeah, because I was like, <laughs> see, this is the start. Wash it down with a white girl. With a white girl. Yeah, white girl. See, that was basic. Yeah, it was nice. See, I told you. Yeah, I got to shake it up. Now we're ready. I've had a free workout. Oh, so the free workouts are anything like I haven't used in a really long time. Essentially, you suck these down to about 12 a day and just operate on caffeine and anxiety until about 2 p.m. and then have lunch. some point this will evolve to me lifting the same weights that a 130 pound female is also lifting. But my arms are real heavy so if you factor that weight in, it's still kind of a bitch. Yeah, your legs don't go back and what? You know, your arms, it's almost like rotating. 
rotate. So I want your arms more in that position. Not too much stress on your shoulders, but yeah, you need to act as a board and engage your arm here. So from okay. here to here, you're not moving. You're specifically with your elbow down, coming up. So allowing yourself to go down, totally stretch. Come on, come back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So one arm is going to be in this position.
not make any sense to. No, no. Hey, that is the way it is. Why are you so heavy? All right. You feel all right? You feel it? You feel it? All right. Don't doubt yourself. In a week with a sub of an emptiness you left behind. Now, you have to be Obviously, you're a former athlete, and all sunny athletes, so stuff comes to you naturally. But it's just that difference. It's different Still got in there fast. That's fast. right. You just, you just, yep. If I feel like I want to do another 10 or 20, then I can do it. I just make that change in my mind and I just do it. Okay. It's never number. So like, if you want to do an extra fucking 10, just fuck it. Rip it out. All right. That's right. Until you feel like you started down great injury. Yeah, yeah. Pain's okay. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm familiar injury. with good pain and bad pain. Yeah. Yeah. Bad pain looks like. Yeah, that's that's bad. Yeah. Trying to sleep, but the silence is haunting this room every night. I can stand to feel this way. My body's breathing out your name. Didn't want to say goodbye to you, bye to you, but you're gone. Oh, I wish the sun. I'm 
getting bigger.
trying to keep shoulders back or you let them come forward? You know, I kind of I kind of like to do a little bit of both. Yeah, I okay. guess I'm not really explaining much. I kind of let myself go as far forward. To get and a stretch. I'll, oh yeah, I'll let those shoulders go as far as I basically can. But then I kind of, yeah, get them back and almost re-pull up my chest. Uh, gotcha. I kind of squeeze that, but I do it. I kind of like, I kind of drop myself back in that position. Gotcha. And sometimes I'll just stay in this position. See, and that's my tendency is doing that is because of benching and everything for lifting. And that's I pin everything back. And so I just stay here instead of getting that stretch through the front right. I, I like to kind of do both. I kind of like to have that stretch and to get it and then once I kind of engage myself in that, then I kind of shorten that range of motion and now get that that's exactly it. So I go through the full range of motion at the beginning and I'll let myself stretch and squeeze it. Yep. And then kind of at that end point when I know I have like five or ten more left in me, then I kind of shorten that range of motion. I really try to like isolate and engage and I think really squeeze Good. Exactly. Yeah. 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 Five more. There you go. That's essentially as many as I would do for my entire <laughs> back well, day. I see the difference. I didn't like really make this the smartest way to do it because realistically, we probably would have trained a larger muscle group like that. Smart. And then we would have realistically probably started doing biceps where we've already trained the biceps. So now that's kind of screwed us to go heavier on that. Gotcha. But sometimes so, doing that is good versus always doing the larger muscle group. So like if you were going to do chest, would you bench first, like do a main movement and then hit all the pieces? Technically, yes, but I like kind of flipping it on its head, if you will, almost taking the opposite There's way. There's no wrong way as long as we're just killing it. That's basically the Fuck, all right. Essentially, <laughs> the answer is just smash it with a hammer. <laughs> Like check my form, I will. Yeah. 
I will. Yeah, why wouldn't you? I mean, what's on top of it? It gives me like... Well, the reason I recorded all my throws for fucking eight years. Right, you learned yourself. Yeah. Where am I fucking at? I've had someone show me with like side delt that you like want pinkies. Yes, yes. Oh, yes, to try to, because otherwise I'm just out here. Correct, and yeah, that's something like that's very hard. Or same thing with tricep extensions. They talk about, who Joey Swalks talk about pushing to your pinky. And really, in that like outside, it's, yeah, 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 it makes. That's a bench cue too, though. Like, think about squeezing oh. the bar with your pinky to like okay. get extra. Months out. Yeah, yeah, 72 months I could be easily ready for stage. I guess some longer board shorts, maybe a jacket. Yeah, it's different, different federation. So that's it. Arms, they don't do much anymore. Getting it. I'll be back. We'll do more of these. Yeah. You can tell me. It's just, like I said, a little warm up to a. I don't know why I go by my toes. You get taller, it's better. Your muscles lengthen. No? Shit. One of these days. Anyway, thank you guys for playing along with my muscle making. And uh, this is Kristen Nunn. She's amazing. Follow her. And uh, she'll be back to help me improve these guys. Right. Yes. 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 I will. I've got to that. All right. And then you can teach me your technique. Yes.